Hi everyone, this is Rick from 15 Diamond Village, and we're playing at the PAC, which is the Portuguese American Club in Lawrence, Massachusetts. I'm playing an SL5, we just did the lag, and uh, Jake just won the lag. And I'm an SL5, so that's a race to four. Okay, so Jake just broke, and I believe he broke dry. So to me, the low ball looks better. You got three in the center there. Uh, the two might go. The seven, the seven, the one, and the four will go. The two might be a problem, but I can get on it with the seven possibly, or the one from behind later. Depends on how it goes. So yeah, I do the five, just stop and roll or stop, and I'll have choice. I'm probably gonna go for the uh, six. Set me up for the three coming back or the four, depends on how we hit it. Yeah. Okay, so it's coming down to the two in the side. Perfect. I saw that earlier. I remember seeing that shot, but. Nice. That set me up for the one or the seven. Uh, well, the one, anyway. I caught up on that ten ball. Oh, got it. Okay, now I have the, uh, looks like, if I could see the seven, I want to take that right now and set up the three coming back up table. The line is perfect. That's what I'm doing, setting up the line right now here. I'm looking at the line. No. Oh. Maybe I was deciding, I was trying to decide to take the three first, but that wouldn't set me up for anything. Once so I stun it out, hit the rail on the left on the upper rail, and then I come back down to the four. But no, the seven's better if I can see it, yes. Oh, couldn't see it. <laughs> I hit his ball and that's ball in hand. So he's got a cluster he's gotta take care of right now. Uh, 14 or on the side, or you can do What's that, the 12 in that pile next to the 8? I think so. 14 on the side, I think he's going for. Uh, okay, yeah, well, we can do that first, then the 14 on the side. So 11 up top, and then 14 on the side, yeah. See, I would have broken both out at once. I would have used the 11 up top and broken both out right there. But, uh, because that 12 is still on that 8. Okay, we did it that way. <laughs> you know, it's better to get it early as possible because sometimes you don't have the opportunity. I'm sure you saw that. So. Uh, so now the 12 has to go because that's really all he has. Well, he has the 15 also. And it might break out his cluster he's looking at right now. No, oh, he's going for the 12 and coming back with some low. Bumpy 8, so it didn't work out. Totally missed it. <laughs> I don't know what the hell that was. <laughs> Oops. Oops. All right. So I get ball in hand, and I should be able to go out on this. Um, should. <laughs> Plenty of ways to do this. Yeah, that's one of them. Pop it inside, come down for the four, go for the seven, come around for the eight. I'd rather go in the other direction, so yes. Yeah, stop. I have an angle. I have an angle on that. I got an angle, good. I could go for the seven right now, actually, and then this, this the four, come back to the eight. I think that's a better way. Because the, the angle might bump the seven. On the other hand, it might not. Uh, if I put a little low, uh, a little right. I did just enough to get around it. Good thing, because if I bump that, that you don't want to do that. I could have messed it up. Uh, I hit it a little hard. I still have a shot. Yeah, of course not. <laughs> I should have had that shot. <laughs> okay, so now he's got a breakout shot with his 15. Oh, 
Safe. He's doing a safe. And he didn't make it, I don't think. Or oh, maybe he did. Yeah, I think he did block me. I'm sorry. But I'm going to kick at this. Easy kick. I got it. And I didn't hit the rail. I remember this. Uh, sorry for the block there. But he was checking to see if it hit the rail. I know what I did. Mean. Just missed it. <laughs> okay. So whoever... People that don't know about the uh, APA rule on that, that's, uh, you gotta hit the rule out. You have to hit the bank after you hit the object ball. Something has to hit a bank. Either a cue ball or an object ball. Any object ball. Okay, that's correct, after. Uh, it would have been a nice save, but he didn't hit a rail, so I get ball right now. That, that should be it now. That is it, I'm sure. Easy out. I put a little angle just to bring it a little closer, to stun it up. I didn't have to, but it made it much easier. <clears throat> so I'm calling the pocket. APA is supposed to mock him up, but uh, you could agree on that. You, you could agree on, you know, not mocking it. And we agreed on it, so. So I got a uh, seven in. Low ball. Unless something else went in. I'm not sure. Alright, so I'm looking at the table. Uh, if I did, in fact, have a low, it's not great. I don't have that two all the way up. That'll give me the three. Yeah, I was doing a cross lock. I didn't have it all the way up, so. I tried to uh, cross the face there, uh, bank shot, pep bank, just missed it. Yeah, he's got an easy combo there, he got this uh, 14 on the side, which is what he wants first. Yeah. And he can have the, the combo or the 15. He doesn't like the combo, it's a little angle. Uh, not much. I mean, I, I like that combo. Did break it out though. I'm not so sure about the 11. That, that 11 looks like it's still not. I mean, the 9. I'm sorry, the 9 ball it didn't look like it uh, cleared the 8 on that side, but on the other side maybe. Although my 1, I'm smoking my 1 right now. So I'm going to go for 1. And this 9 will be cleared on that side, but I need to get that out of there. That's good. And I get the 15. I have a couple of issues here. I have the uh, set the 12 behind is 5. It's also a problem for him though. And my 13 right there in front of his 4 in the corner, upper right hand corner pocket. Which is what I'm looking at. So I'm going to try to hit my 4 off the 3. So I'm going to hit the 3 into the 4, get it in the pocket, try to get it in. It's a little tricky from where it's sitting, so maybe not. It's a little tricky. I probably I would have missed it altogether and, and opened his pocket. So opened his uh, 13, and he, that wouldn't have been too smart, you know. All right, so I'm gonna go for this uh, side pocket. I know it's a, America's favorite scratch shot, but I know how to fix it. I, I know how to take care of those. So I, instead, I decided with the two. All right. Uh oh, I'm gonna scratch anyway. Look at this. <laughs> All the way down. Hit that soft, but that's how it is on the bank. When you're hitting this bank head on, it always does that, you know. It picks up a lot of speed, so you got a really soft touch for that. So this is nine that I was talking about. Like it's clear because the one's out of the way. And I can just cut that in at 12, 10. And just the 12 is going down and tied up is 12. I should say 12 goes over here, but uh, the uh, 13 next to it doesn't. Neither does my ball, my four. Let's see what happens here. I'm gonna do a lot of draw on this. Yeah, definitely want to draw the heck out of this. So bring it all the way back. Try to bank into it. Always bring it down. Hey, got on it. Nice shot. Not too bad. 
Not too shabby. <laughs> Got a nice cut. Brings it down for the. Uh, bring it right down for the. Just to set them right up. Cut the opening too. Make the little two balls right there. Bang. He's got it. No problem. Good speed. That will make it a tied up game. One to one. Tied up. Break it up now. I thought I cut this out. I guess I didn't. Sorry about that. I try to cut all these, you know, rackings out. I did I, the rest of this. I'm sure I did, but I missed one, so apologize about that one. doesn't look bad because my one and his 12 are tied up with the eight my one could get around it possibly but that 12 is no good so he can break it out right now actually and that's what he's trying to do he went low so I guess maybe he wasn't trying you have to put high on that cut it over and break it out but then again you're taking a risk on that eight ball going flying <laughs> I gotta hit it softer Places to put the camera in this uh, in this facility. Yeah. I couldn't tell. I couldn't really see it. <laughs> I was in the way. All right. He's not high, so I don't know. He doesn't have much of anything. I did much good safe there. I don't know. Yeah, good shot. He did a nice back cut on that mink. Got it in. Set up for that 10 or 12. What's that? 12. No, 10. 12 stuck. So he can get that out right now. That's what he did. That was the shot, definitely. But he did miss the shot, so it didn't help. I got an easy shot on the 3. And it brings me up table. The plenty of balls there. I can just put it center. Center. Oh, I don't know if I can see that. No. I don't know. I don't think I can see that one. If I can, I'm not sure. little easy combo there <coughs> two all the way up or the five down there let me see yeah because the two goes in this pocket so I'm not worried about it I want to go for the two I want to stun it but not enough to scratch obviously I could stun it right into the side pocket going for it all the way down yeah now I set up for the three or the one if that one does go Well, I didn't hit it right. <laughs> yes, I rushed that shot. You can see it. I never claimed to be the best pool shooter, but I can definitely. I know how to shoot. It's just that uh, you know sometimes you just want to. Sometimes you get in a, in a, in a rhythm, and sometimes you, sh you shouldn't. <laughs> I mean, I wrote a book on this stuff, so I mean, it's, not, it's not like I don't know what I'm talking about. It's just, <laughs> yeah. Check out my book on Amazon. It's called Bill Billards, A Comprehensive Guide. And it has everything. Everything is in this thing. Name it. I mean, I, I, it took me a few months to write. I mean, I, I went all out on this. But I'm, not, 
I'm not here to, you know, sell the book. I'm just, <laughs> I'm just letting you know I have a book out. So check it. It's uh, the link is in the description for the Amazon to buy it on Amazon, I should say. And I have it on all three formats. There's an ebook. I got a paperback, and now I got a hardcover also. Okay, so we're having a time out here. Jake's having a time out. Save me up. I don't know. Got plenty of shots here. I don't know. Fourteen. Let's put some low on that fourteen. Bring it back. That's all. No, oh, that's what I think he's telling him. Yeah, he's gonna go slightly over the ball. Maybe though. Oh, he's got the fifteen right there. there. <laughs> that's. I, I thought that might have been tied, and that's why he had a time out, but apparently not. Yeah, that's what he was told to do, I believe. <coughs> Good time out. He's got him off. So he's going to try to do the 10 and come back. I don't see why. I would go for the 14 all the way up and then roll it up and get the 10 on this corner. And the lower right hand corner. I missed it anyway. Okay. too far I could have got caught up but I got that seven I need that seven out of there all right that's the problem the one is not an issue that seven is an issue so I need it out stun it back out for the one that's perfect oh I'm sorry I have the two right there that's even better <laughs> uh, it might be the wrong angle though so if it is I'm gonna go hard and high and I'm gonna go off the rail and come around because I can't go low on the rail Whatever. Yeah, I don't want that anyway if it's on the wrong angle. Uh, well, I miscued. I remember this. That was a miscued dumb shot, and I got it right in anyway off of my one, which helped me. <laughs> so now I got the perfect angle for the one to come around two banks for this for the uh, eight ball. <laughs> I remember that one now. One, two, and I bump it. So not a good position. I mean, anything, anything else would have been much better. <laughs> if I didn't hit it, it would have been really easy. But I hit it, so now I got a tough bank shot. I do a timeout just to be, you know, I have a timeout, so why not? <clears throat> Basically a second opinion, you know. I know what I, I know what I gotta do. I know I can scratch into the, you know, there's all different things you can scratch and stuff. So it's good to talk it over, your captain or whatever. In this case, he's a Ken is a six, so well, everybody on the team knows him. He's a big guy too. This is not anything. This is just I'm eyeballing this. I'm usually better off when I do it that way. There's a lot of high speed and uh, low. Well, right, let's doing it again. That was a good shot. Let's do that again. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Let me get that out of the way. Two to one. All right. Drop. 
enjoy that. Huh? Clusters. The major cluster, the two high balls, and then, and then that low block in it. Though. Oh. He can go for that six in the side and break out that four. Yeah, do that. You can do that now. Oh, the four goes? Oh, okay. I couldn't tell if that went or not. Yeah. <coughs> Another five. Another seven. Oh, he's a five and then roll it up for the three. But I missed it anyway. Okay. Alright, so pretty much open except for this cluster down on the lower, lower right hand side. I should say upper right. The upper right referring to the right. Pocket back. In relationship to the camera angle. You know. So that when I'm shooting now, oops. Never mind. <laughs> okay, when I'm shooting now, the 15 is uh, upper left hand corner. I call that. So upper right. I'm sorry, upper right hand corner. Up. Actually, I'm not sure. <laughs> yeah, upper left was good. This would be the lower left. 14 in the lower left. That sets me up for that 10. But I got a better idea. I want to break out my balls, and this is a perfect angle, and that's what I was setting up. I don't know. Pretty hard. And I cut it out. It was beautiful. I needed to do that because I was dead in the water with that. I don't think that 13 goes. No, that doesn't go. So I have to go for that 12. Ten is near the eight, so that's a twelve. Yeah. I was hoping that thirteen went. That would have been nice. And my eleven is caught up now, behind the five. Get out this 13 all the time. I don't know how to find it. Look at both things. 10 really doesn't give me anything after that. I could leave that. Try to slice that uh, 13 in. Not the easiest shot though. <laughs> five out of the way, which is what I suggested too. That's why I couldn't decide. <clears throat> that will take care of it. I, I could do a ticky off for of the five. That's what I tried to do, but it was too tight. So just to get his five out of there would be fine. Like that. Nice position too. Alright, so he has the seven on the table, that's about it. Yeah, unless he can try to break out his stuff. Right, he's gonna break me out, so he didn't want to do that. Although yeah, for the seven, he's gonna have to go for the one and break it out that way. Yep. Now he has a chance to break it out. And he got it. Unfortunately, he didn't leave him much. He'll just do a bank. Unless he can. Oh, no, he can do the uh, kick shot. Yeah. It's not too tough. Those balls are close together and they're pointed in the right direction, so. The, uh, so if you hit the three, you have a good chance of making the five. <laughs> At least blocking the pocket, one or the other, like that. Now I can see this 13 to go right in the corner pocket, upper right hand corner. That's my only choice right now. Oh, I can try this. And it also sets me up, I can miss it purposely. 
bring a town table. However, the combo, the five, three combo will be easy. No matter where I leave it. Unless I get lucky and get behind the eight and ten. Now we got the 10 in the side. And I'll have to get that 11 to get the 5 out again. Oh, I might be able to get it out right now, actually. Yes. I didn't want it out. I just wanted it. Okay. I should have I should have went for it, but it's okay. After I looked at it now. But he missed, so good position though because then at my 11 <coughs> he's in great he still has an advantage right here all I gotta do is go up and down the table slice it and come back down it's very high because it's gonna go away if I if I don't I could scratch but if I and if I put low it's gonna go away from the 11 so I'm, I'm gonna play it safe here or maybe Try to bank it in. I don't know if that three is just in the way. Gotta back cut it. Yeah, I think I have to try. Because it's dead in the water there. It's not blocking his balls. So I had to get it out of there and I did. Ooh. <laughs> Still got the combo though. <laughs> However, let's see where that three goes. Depends how he hits it, you know. We stayed right there. What nice. That was nice. Looks like he's gonna tie this up. It's gonna set him right up. Just like that. Perfect. Okay. Got a good game going here. Let me tie it up. Pretty much almost everything has a pocket. The low looks a little better to me. Although the high is not bad either. So. I'm gonna go for the low. Yeah, lows look low, lows look great. <laughs> Alright, look at this. Get the one oh, the, let me see. One doesn't really do me much unless I go a little soft and I set up the uh, six. Side. I can do it that way. I can go. Probably go straight down to the. Five also. The five sets up to one. Actually, it's going to go around the two. Yeah, around the two. Okay, bump the two. We still get the one. Right? Yeah, I think so. Oh, they just had it, yeah. Stop shot. Oh. I could have just stopped that. It would have been easier. Because then I could have went for the two, then the four. And then the six on the side. And the eight. Come back out for the eight. Uh, seven down there, too. That's, they're all open. So the four now will set up the seven. I go soft. It's easy here. Like that. So I got a nice angle. Come back up table. Alright, I got a shot on that six, I gotta take it because it might be blocked the other way out. Very good. And I could slice the let me see. Slice the two inside or the seven. Lower left hand corner. Bring it back up again. Which is not easy. I mean not hard, because it's gonna come right back up. But I don't wanna I think that ten might be blocking that car. Yeah, I just have to be careful. I'm gonna go for the two first. Uh, 
Alright, I was trying to stun it out instead, and then I had the seven. Yeah, it would, it would, that would have been good, but I missed. <laughs> I missed! You know, you concentrate on the, uh, on the leaf, and then you don't do the, you, know, you missed a shot, so. I mean, it's, it happens. That's gonna happen, but no one's perfect, right? <laughs> is safe here, so I'm do too. Nice. Okay, hey, you got on that seven. Perfect. Perfect angle. It would have been really easy. That would have been simple. Well, it's got a much harder shot with a scratch, maybe. And I'm going over a ball, so this is not an easy shot. Very hard shot. Now. Without the uh, 11 there, yeah, I can handle it, but not. You're gonna go low. Right, if you go, let's see if I. The tangent line is right down. So I'm looking at the tangent line. Alright. See, if I didn't have that obstructing ball, I can work with it, but it's, well, I'm worried about it. I don't want to scratch and give it, this game away. This is going to be the hill right here. I'm trying to go over the ball. It's going to be hard. And I just missed it. But I did not scratch because I did the low, so I'm happy about that. <laughs> Alright, so he's got all open balls now, and the eight balls sitting next to a pocket, a center pocket. So it doesn't look too tough here. One for me. And here they go. Clear it up. See the 13 on the side. Yeah. Oh, he hit it. I think he hit it on me. Yeah, he did. Okay, so I got to do a kick shot on this one. Yeah, this is dangerous. This can scratch down, down on either corner. So, I definitely can't see it, okay, the 11 blocked it, but I can see the, the back of it. But that's dangerous, if you hit it just a little off, it goes scratch from the upper left hand corner. If, it, if it's off the other way, I can even scratch, I can scratch on the side or on the other, the lower left hand corner. So, That's what I want to do. I want to kick at it. Where's Where's Ken? <laughs> Ken, where are you? Yeah, I believe he just says the same thing. I if I where I was pointing was to go all the way down, but you can scratch right in the side. So I rather hit it a little more square, which is a little more towards the point. Uh, just a little more. Uh, it's about. It's it's tough, you know. So he sees what I'm talking about. You know? Yeah, right there. That's where I want to hit it. Right there. Yeah. He's gonna put his finger just the same spot. Okay. I know what I'm gonna do. All right. Dangerous. Gotta go soft. I mean, not soft, soft, but medium soft because a medium speed will can scratch easily. Hit that off at one degree off and it's gone. On a pocket. Be careful here. See how it's going right towards the corner pocket. It went, the eight ball didn't go, but I didn't scratch, so <laughs> I guess I'll have to take that. That was a tough one. That was a tough one. I got out of that one. Woo! Oof. Phew. 
to win a safe. But I got a good kick on that. Yeah, actually, it's blocked. My kick is blocked that way. Yeah. That was a good save. I'm going to have to put a lot of English on it to get what I'm doing right now. I have to put a lot of English on that. <laughs> because that's not set up for that shot. That's set up to go to miss it completely on the, when it's right. When the eight ball's right. But I'm going to put some left. There's a lot of left here. There you go. And I did hit it. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't hit it. Just missed it. That's <laughs> why. Okay. Ball in there. I mean, it was a tough shot. I had to go away. If I had a square, yeah, I would have got that all day long. Two banks is easy on that. That's a simple two banker. Could have got straight in or two banks. Two banks would be preferable. A little to the left hand side of that eight, I would have did it that way. Because then, there's no way you're going to scratch. Unless you hit it, smash it, and then it comes around and scratches in the side. The other side. But I wasn't about to hit it hard. All right. the hill on this one if I get it didn't get it yet but you smash that it comes all the way up here in this pocket right here boom although the 14 might be getting nicked the 14 so not too sad not too bad. <laughs> he's pissed throwing a stick down on the table because he knows I get the hill that's why well because he gave me the shot you know it happens though, you know. It sucks. It sucks being in that position, you know. Alright. <clears throat> now we go to the break. Pretty good. I'm shooting pretty good today, so this day, this night, whatever. Just feeling good. You know, you feel good sometimes. You know, sometimes you don't. Sometimes you feel like a nut. Sometimes you don't. So, uh, didn't see what that was, but whatever. One, two, three, four, five, six. Nice, low ball. Nice. Get over there, because I don't have much. Low ball looks like crap. This is a high ball table right here. I know there's a cluster down there, but that's all even. There's actually more lows. I can get this uh, breakout right here, and I'm going to do it. I mean, I'm, not, I'm sorry, I'm going to try that. Uh, it's safe right here, actually. Yeah, I just wanted to leave it. That's a safe, believe it or not, because I had no shot there. I, I just wanted to put the ball right where I put it. I mean, he has a shot, but it's a little tougher. It's got to raise the stick up and jack it up. So he doesn't have much. No, he's not even going for it. No, he gave me the shot. I got the seven. It came out just right. Should have hit that easy. Hit it way too hard. <clears throat> it just misses nine though. Yeah, that's where the uh, cue ball's going. I see. I'm doing a combo. Never mind. Maybe I couldn't see the seven. But either way, I'm doing this combo because that's my problem. And that was a nice. Yeah. I remember that now. Okay. All right. Now I see the seven. Come around for the five. If I can get perfect position. It's a tough one. Oh, I can come up for the two. Okay. Much easier. Well, 
I came up with a two, but I didn't get it on the, I didn't get the seven. <laughs> no, I had that too easy. Catch that up and go to the, yeah, what it was. Send to the five would have been tough. All right, here we go. Straight in. Go that way, you can go the other. What was it giving? I squeezed it in there. Between the 8 and the 5, yep. Okay. Mm. Oh, see it? Oh, maybe you can't see it. The 5 might be blocking it from cutting it in. I'm gonna slice this 12 in now. Oh, it gave me the shot. Didn't even block it. I don't know if he was trying to make it or not, because, yeah, because he could have had the 15 next, but. <sighs> Looking at that 5, I can get at that 5 right now. I know the 2, I can come down for the 5, yes. Or the 7. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to bring it down, go up, hit the bank, come down, obviously. Alright, I got around it, I got the 7. Perfect. Now that, that four, I know the four only goes in that pocket, so I'm gonna try to get that. I don't think I got it. I'm just gonna go safe here. Oh no, I'm gonna slice it in and get it on the side, side of the four. That'd be beautiful. All right, well, I missed it and I bumped his ball and I would have been stuck anyway. So he's got the nine and that's about, I don't know, that uh, 10 might go in the side there. The 10 goes in the side. I can't tell from here, but looks like it might. He's, the, he's trying to see if it goes. If not, it goes all the way up. So it does have that 10. Is that a 14 or 10? I can't see if it's green or blue. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so he doesn't have it. He's gonna do a try a safety. Yeah, you can do a safe there, definitely. Just hit the ball. There you go. All okay, right, I remember this. <laughs> Everybody's like, "Oh, good one." <laughs> I don't do this once, but I do it twice. I mean, this this is crazy. <laughs> oh man. Second time was even harder, much harder. I had a pinpoint accuracy. All right, so this here is my shot. I know I raised the stick because I always get it that way. It never fails me, all right? And I'm in the pocket, so I can't hit it straight on. But, <laughs> again, <laughs> I'm saying it's in the pocket. Now, this gotta be perfect. Now, the reason why I get this is because I aim it and I push that ball exactly on the point I want, and that way I hit it, see that? I'm glad that guy wasn't in the way. I know it's not a great, nothing great or anything, but you can't see that. Mine's in the way, no way. What? Nah, nine goes. He, he needs to get that though. Oh, maybe it does. I don't think so. Nah, it didn't go. He would've hit my ball. Okay, now we got you. It's a tough shot. It's off the rail. My, my cue ball's on the rail. I have to cut that. Just like I figured I would, but it, ew, I think it goes, uh, definitely goes in where his hand is, that's for sure. Anyway, all right, all his are free. His 11 does go in either pocket. My four might not go in the lower left, but it goes in the upper left. All right, now, he might break me out here. If he goes to the 10, he won't, but if he goes to that 9, Good chance he will. He's gonna hit my four. But I don't know what he does. Okay, so he's going for the ten. And he missed, so he broke me out anyway. <laughs> That's how yeah, that was unlucky for him. Oh man. And I came around and I got the shot all the way up. It's game. Game time. Alright. Anyway, if you guys 
thanks for watching i hope you guys like if you don't mind please like this uh, video and subscribe if you have. Right. have a great day everyone take care